hello hello my lovely people good morning good afternoon good evening good night welcome to my youtube channel my name is jane this is the first time you're seeing me thank you so much for stopping by my return subscriber Mwah! from me to you thank you so much so today uh my two nieces visited me this one is from patakos this one from where from Ekiti State, and you guys already know this little baby four year old, my little baby girl. So, today, uh, this one will be going home tomorrow, this one will be going on Tuesday, and this one is stuck with me. So, I just want to come, they want to be on my channel, and I am happy that they're going to be on my channel. So, my name is Jane, welcome to our YouTube channel, and let us introduce ourselves. And this baby girl is what's your name? Good girl. How old are you, baby? Four years. Oh my goodness. Thank you so much for your name. What is your name, uh, my learners? I'm Rosalind. Rosalind from Ekiti State. I've not seen them in a very, very long time. So when I visited, this is a big opportunity for them to stop by and see me. And this big girl here is? Mona Pius. Mona Pius. Monachi Pius. So let me tell you the real name, Monachi Pius. Mm -hmm. So they are my, my nieces and they just stopped by to see me. And we are all, so we are, we are here today. We're talking about the importance of having PVC. Hey, God. God. <laughs> some people are closing their eyes, some people. So I just want you guys to, okay. I just mm -hmm. want them to tell you guys the importance of having your PVC. That this year, eh? That this year, whether they will want it or not, that we are going to make a difference. All of us youth, yes, I'm one of the youth. Of so I know so. you guys, you guys don't believe that I'm a youth. Yeah, I know. I know, but that's okay. We are in the village. By the time I finish weaving this head, when I am coming back, you wouldn't even recognize me. But I, I like it just the way it is. I just came back. I'm tired. I'm even ready to. Go. I just took a shower with cold water. And I didn't even feel the cold. I am so hot, like crazy. So please excuse all the the way I look, okay? We just want to come here and tell people the importance of making sure that you get your PVC. Your PVC is your voter's registration card that tells you that this is your right. This is your right that you must get your PVC this 2023. If you don't have it, don't say anything. If you don't have this PVC we're talking about, do not say anything. Do not. But I'm going to ask the person that have this PVC, that know the importance of this PVC, that know what this PV, this PVC is about to do. So my little niece, uh, Monachi, will tell you guys the importance. So Monachi, talk to your people. I'm going to come over here. Okay, good afternoon, good day, good morning, good evening, everybody. Um, once again, I'm Munachi Pius. Okay, we want to talk about the importance of PVC. It's really important, like very, very important. Especially to we, the Nigerians that are here, we really need that, that PVC so that we can vote these people, like those people that feels like that seat belongs to them. These people that feels like that position, it's their birthright. We need to let them know that no, it's not their birthright. And we also need to vote them out so that we can have opportunities. We can have good roads, we can have water, we can have um, food and everything we need. We need to vote them out. And secondly, let's talk about it. How come the old people want to always rule and the, side, uh, the youth are the leaders of tomorrow? So now let's talk. When will the youth take over? The youth, when are we leading? It's a question mark. And every one of us need to answer this question. When are we going to lead? It's now. We need to start now. And how do we start it? It's by voting out the old people so that the youth will take over. And if, how can we vote them? It's not by campaigning. It's not by everybody saying um, this person, we want this person, we want that person. No, it's by having our PVC. We need to get our PVC and 
vote and we don't need to be scared on the voting day on the day of election we don't need to be scared we need to come out like other maybe other days we might be scared oh this won't happen but no this time around let's take it very serious because if we don't take it serious we will suffer for another four years and we all know what it is thank good. you very good so your your regular pvc you get it from the village right and since you cannot go home to vote over there uh, at home, what did you do since you live in Port Harcourt, What did you do to make sure that you get your PVC in Port Harcourt where you live? Okay, um, the previous one I had, it was in my place in the village that's in Imo State. Now, because I want to vote in Port Harcourt, I don't want to start running back home. I had to go to the INEC office and um, did my what is it called transfer I, I was supposed to show you the transfer the one they gave me the permanent the um temporary one Do so you have I, it yes i have it Go on, get my it. okay please hold on okay my little niece here will tell you guys the importance of having that pvc why monachi is getting her pvc to show you guys so they talk to people um, in Yoruba and let them understand. Ekaro, <laughs> Tori, asikota wa yi, PVC wa agbara wani. PVC wa agbara wani. Ka, ka, ka konja de loku. Koni di kama beru. Eni ken ni kosi. Gishi a iton, ibi tu wan jo kosi yi a wan e. O ti to, asikoti to, ka mon kwe, ka sofun wan kwe. I joba wan, kote wan la, kote wan la wun. I joba a wan, a wan agba. Kote wan la wun mo. So, keep Bobo and Ward, dog. Can't judge any lock boy and so can't lock the book. Like me, Ben. I laugh here for you. Thank you. Thank you. So, uh, Monachi is back. So, Monachi will continue from where she stopped and show you guys her own PVC because every where she is going, she has her PVC. Mama showed her. Okay. Um, this is my own PVC. Like, it's for the transfer. If you see there, it says voter transfer application you mm -hmm. check it you see it very well there okay. and i actually did it like i had the other one but because i cannot vote where i did it where i can't vote in port Harcourt, i had to go and do this one i had to go and transfer it from Imo state to port Harcourt, to river state mm -hmm. and also had uh, to a particular to a particular polling unit so that i will vote and I was asked, because I did it in um, July, yes, July. And they said we should come and pick it up on November ending. So next month, I am going to pick the permanent one. So this is the temporary one? This is the temporary one, yes. Okay. I'll be going to pick the permanent one. And I believe we all should also go and do the same thing. Thank you. Good. So my people, uh, it is when I hear from this youth, that tells you that something is about to go go nuts in this Nigeria that we are in. I am not able to vote because I don't live here and I'm not going to be. I didn't read if I had registered or if I was here when they were registering, I would have done everything to make sure that I register so I, on the day of election I will come home. But guess what? Where we are, Pito B told us that this year will be the only year that Nigerians abroad will not vote. So my dear. These people, they have a lot coming for us. This P2B, eh? If he can make that when he gets there, because he's already there, he's going to be there. These yeah, children, sure. these youth, these youth will he's make it happen. Already. He's going to be there. Yeah. So when he finally gets there, and then he made it a law that Nigerians abroad, which is over 16 million Nigerians in abroad, will be able to vote. Nobody can tell us anything, no. Nobody can tell us anything because when Nigerians abroad vote, you cannot bribe Nigerians abroad. What can you give Nigeria abroad? 
you cannot bribe Nigerians abroad. And Nigerians abroad will make a big difference in any election because everywhere that you are, Americans vote everywhere, including here in Nigeria. They vote here and their vote must be counted in America. They will vote it transfer, then it will be counted. Until all those votes come in, election will not be done. So my lovely people, I just thought that you hear from the youth. And I wanted her to say it in Yoruba because she lives in Yoruba now. So that she can encourage all the Yoruba people uh, to please, if you don't have your PVC, go and get your PVC. It is very, very important. This one is still four years old. It has a long way to go. So my lovely people, that's what this video is all about. I thank you all so much for watching. I thank you all so much. So please, my people, just say bye-bye to them. Please bye -bye. subscribe bye -bye. if you have bye -bye. not. For seeing this village look, come on, subscribe now. What will it take you to subscribe? And it's free of charge. So subscribe. For those of you that have done it, from me to you, I love you so much for supporting.